Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Tiffany Beeston from Beauty and the Beastons and I upload every single Tuesday and Sunday. I hope you're all enjoying all the August content so far. I did go ahead and make a content calendar, which I'll put on one of the sides of me. I'm not sure. We'll see which one fits better. But anyway, be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss out on any of those videos. Today we are doing a Timu home and beach haul. But not only are we going to do a haul, I'm also going to go ahead and unbox everything and test it all out. If you don't know what Timu is, it's an online marketplace that offers the most competitively priced products in multiple categories, fashion, jewelry, home decor, and more. New users even get first purchase discounts for more savings. There's hundreds of coupons, exclusive prices, extra percentages off, and there's even games that you can play in app to win free gifts. Timu is actually the number one free app in the app store right now, and it's getting recognized everywhere by so many different celebrities and influencers, which is how I found out about it. Not only does Timu have a 90 day free return policy, they also provide you with an estimated processing and shipping time. And if your package is delayed, they will give you a $5 credit. So before we get into it, I want to let you know that if you download the Timu app through the link in my description box below, you get a $100 coupon bundle for free. All you have to do is use the coupon code on the screen here. Again, I'll have everything linked down below. I also have another deal on one of the products here, but we'll get into that a little bit later. Let's start off this haul. So there's actually a couple of items that I've already been using. This basket, this is a rattan basket. It's very cute. I love the lining in it. It has like little daisies on it. And we use this to hide some of our camera equipment because we don't have a desk. So we just put everything in here and put it on our bookshelf and it's perfect. It comes in a couple of different sizes and I will have every item linked down below. Next up is this like little LED strip light. I like that it comes with like little stickers on the back. So if you wanted to stick it up on something like under your cabinets or something, you could. But we have been using this on our bookshelf because our bookshelf is right near our bathroom door. So if we get up in the middle of the night, this automatically turns on and we use it as like a little night light. So tonight I'll add in a little clip of how this works once it gets dark out. So this is probably one of the items I am most excited for and that I just think is an amazing deal is this little bag that I use for like when we go on the boat or when we go to the beach. I have another one that I'm going to compare it to really quickly. So this is the large, I think it's called rose red one on the website or on the app. And here is my other bag. So this one, the only difference is this one is like a little bit more... I don't know, flexible. This one's a little bit more stiff, but otherwise I don't see a huge difference. I love these bags because first of all, this is a fraction of the price of this one, but they're great because you can easily get sand out of them and rinse them out. So highly, highly recommend this. Plus it's just really perfect for when you have kids and you're going anywhere. You can use it for the park, wherever, but I just really like how it has the holes. You can just shake the sand out or rinse it off with the hose, which is what I usually wind up doing. Speaking of the kids and like beach and stuff like that, I got these self-sealing water splash balls. They're, they call them happy water bombs. They're basically um, reusable water balloons, which Carter got some of these for his birthday and we love them and use them all the time. So I'm excited to test these out again because it was just a fraction of the price of the other ones. So let's see how these work. Okay, so there is a 12 pack here. And the first thing I thought about was that I love with the other ones are that they are magnetic and they close very easily and these seem to be exactly the same as you can see here. So let's see how they fill up. No water leakage, now let me just throw it. So as you saw, they are legit and this is also a much bigger pack than the other one that we got. So this is just a cute little bag, pretty self-explanatory that I grabbed for the farmer's market around here. We have lots of local farmer's market where we can just go. We also have a community garden where we can grab produce and just throw it right in here. Especially in New Jersey, there is a no plastic bag law, so we always need bags wherever we go. This would also be cute for sand toys, um, store those balloons in. There's endless possibilities. Next up are these pompous, 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 I think that's how you say it. I needed something to go under the TV in here and I think these would be great. I'm actually going to open it from this way so I can pick it up by the ends. Let's see. They look really pretty. Hopefully they're long enough to fit in there. So they did come individually tied so that if you wanted to you can just stick them in but I think I want to kind of, you know, 
put a couple of each into the vases. Let's just see how it looks. You will need a vacuum after this, by the way. Okay, they look really good. I'm probably going to rearrange them like 10,000 times because that's how I am. But now might be a good time to try our next product, which is a little handheld vacuum. I honestly um, thought of keeping this in the car because we always have like so many crumbs and stuff, but we can totally test it out here first. I feel like every bomb car needs this for all the crumbs and the sand, but we're gonna test it out here. It did come with a suction stick right here, a brush, what they're calling a floor mop, and then this little USB charging cable. So let's test this out. I give it a 10 out of 10. There might be other colors, but I got the green one. So while we're in the cleaning realm right now, let's go ahead and test out this broom, which all of my audience gets this broom for only a dollar and nine cents, literally a dollar nine. So let's see how this works. Okay, so here at the Bay House, there's literally always sand on the floor. So we use lots of brooms, this comes in handy. You did see that I had to put it together, which was very easily easy, and there's instructions. I like how it has this little handle here um, that this just attaches to, and then you can also even fold the dustpan up if you wanted to. So, like that, put this inside, and easily store it like this, a dollar and nine cents. I think yes. I also got two electric cleaning brushes. This one is a lot smaller and it comes with a couple different sized heads. Um, they show on the back that you can use it pretty much on anything. And then I also got this larger one. So let's unbox this and see what it looks like. It says it's a brush, a sponge, and a polisher. Okay, so when we take the bottom off, that's where you charge it at. Comes with a little charger right here. Let's see if there's any power. Okay, so I have the scrub attachment on now. There's also the sponge and then the little shiner. <laughs> Another thing that I'm liking that I don't remember when I ordered this is that it comes with a little thing for you to attach it on somewhere. It would be great under the sink with a little 3M sticker. Pretty cool. All right, let's test it out on the sink here. Let's put some soap, some water. Oh yeah. Okay, I definitely love this and think it'll be a staple because you know that I'm like always needing the sink nice and clean. I'm gonna stick this up. Let me just put it on here. Let's see how far it needs. Perfect. Someone just woke up from their nap, but now we are testing this electric toothbrush for giants. Oh, I like it. <laughs> it does require four AA batteries. Four AA? It's strong though, and the bristles are very, very like tough and strong, so this will definitely be like an amazing scrubber. I see this being really good for like bathroom cleaning and those like little spots that are hard to get, so let's try it. Next up, I have two laundry related items. And if you saw my schedule, you know that we're doing a laundry room makeover, so you might have to wait to see this one in action because I want to save this for that video. But this is a really cute collapsible laundry basket. Um, so I have a larger one like this, but this was really affordable. It's a great size. They're great because it's a space saver. Um, 
and they're just really easy. Even if I'm just like picking up around the house or whatever, I might bring this around and put all the toys in it and then put things back where they belong or if there's stuff that needs to go upstairs. But it's also great for laundry, great to keep in your trunk for groceries or whatever. Basically, you can use these for everything and I love them. So here is the laundry detergent container. I love the aesthetic of it and also it seems very spacey, space saving as well since it's thin. It even has a cap if you want to measure um, your laundry detergent. Um, it even shows like the measurements on here. And then just a little pour spout. Then you take it off and that's how you fill your laundry detergent. Very cute, easy. And of course I would have to label it. Next up, we've got these like heavy duty black hooks. They also come with the hardware needed to hang them, but Chris actually wanted these to be able to hang our beach chairs up on in our little, kind of like a garage, but I wouldn't call it a garage, our storage area. So I like it. They're very nice and sturdy. They have like a little plastic protectant here as to not like scrape anything up. You can use these to hang anything. They're very incredibly sturdy and you can see it has a bunch of spots to make sure that they are staying in the wall. This is the hardware it comes with. It even comes with the drywall anchors. I got this cute holder. You can use it for keys and like put stuff inside here like that you might need when you're running out of the house. I don't think it would fit a pair of sunglasses, a little too small. That's what I was going to say. It comes with screws and everything, but it also comes with just like 3M type sticker that I can go on the back. So that's what I'm going to use it for. I was thinking about either using it for like some of the girls' headbands or necklaces. Um, I'm not quite sure yet. These are like little tiny containers that come with adhesive to put like on the inside of a cabinet or anything like that. I got these thinking of like the girls' little hair accessories in mind, like their little butterfly clips or their um, bobby pins, things like that. So let's open one up. So you can see here, it just has like this little compartment. Close it up. It's also a space saver. I'm sure you can put other things in there as well, um, like school supplies and things like that. So I'm excited because I got these flower stems that kind of are just pretty daisies that I love. I think they're daisies. Um, but they're just very neutral and go with anything. So I want to take them out and put them into this vase and either keep them on the island or on the dining room table. I'm not sure yet. Beautiful. This is just like a really pretty flower type wreath. I didn't order this, they sent this to me, but it's very, very cute. And I could see it like more towards spring and stuff. I love all the pink colors, or if you have like a baby girl nursery that you're working on, I feel like this is adorable. All right, so this is a set of some cute little ceramic um, pots. I can see this for like a cute little herb garden or just as decor on your mantle. Let me take it all out real quickly. So I think this would also be great for succulents. They do all have a drainage hole at the bottom. You now like a ceramic feel. You can see there's six in a set and I'll go ahead and do like a little close up. You guys know I love my essential oils. I don't burn candles, so essential oils kind of make up for that amongst many other things that they do. But I always have the house smelling good with oil, so I grabbed this essential oil diffuser. It's adorable, I think. Would you call this for 10? I don't know, guys, what do you call it? But it's just very beautiful. I'm gonna set this up and I'll do like a little overlay here. I'm gonna set it up tonight once we get back for, from dinner. And last but not least are these two kitchen items. This is like a bowl slash strainer here, so I'm gonna go ahead and test it out. I have some cucumber here and some mint from my friend's garden, thanks Mitch. And then just some lemon and lime, and I'm gonna make just like 
a refreshing water, but this isn't gonna make my water in. So you can also, of course, make sangria in here, but this is just a cute water dispenser or beverage dispenser that you can infuse with fruit. I'll probably put the mint and cucumber in here and then just let the um, lemon and lime into like the main area, but this is very cute especially for summer and summer drinks. So let's wash this and test it out. All right, let's test this out. It looks so refreshing. Perfect. One of the biggest worries about dispensers is that they leak, and so far, no leaks with this. So. All right, so that is it for today's Timu haul. I hope that you all enjoyed this and got some cool shopping ideas. Don't forget to check them out. All you have to do is download the app and use my code on screen here to get $100 worth of coupons and I will have everything linked down below. Subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you on Tuesday.